Imagine yourself landing on another planet and wanting to move between different locations. They have two unique modes of transportation that are non-existent on Earth. Since you aren't familiar with either of them, you decide to check which means of transport is safer. You asked your alien guide, and he says that one means of transportation causes approximately 3,700 deaths every day, while the other means of transportation results in less than one fatality per day. What would you choose? Obviously, you would choose the second option, since it's safer. Now let's go back to Earth. Actually, this data does refer to Earth. Car accidents kill 3,700 people a day, and airplanes kill far less than one. Statistically speaking, flying is one of the safest means of transportation available. The number of fatalities due to other modes of transportation, such as cars, motorcycles, and bicycles, is significantly higher compared to airplane fatalities. Car accidents result in approximately 1.35 million deaths worldwide each year. In contrast, the global rate of airplane accidents last year was 0.27 per million flights, which translates to one accident for every 3.7 million flights. If you want to know how rare that number is, imagine this. You buy a ticket for an airplane and a ticket for the lottery at the same time. Your chances of winning the big prize in the lottery is 58,000 times higher than your chance of dying in that airplane. Another interesting piece of information that can illustrate how safe airplanes are is that at any given moment, there are 1 to 2 million passengers in the air. And for all that, why are we so afraid of flying? There can be several reasons, such as fear of heights, which some researchers have suggested that fear of heights or falling may be innate to help humans survive. It is an evolutionary response designed to protect us from danger. Another reason could be fear of loss of control. When we travel by car, bus, or train, we are often in control of the vehicle or at least feel like we are. When we fly, we are entirely reliant on the pilot and the crew to get us to our destination safely. Another reason is fear of the unknown. We drive the car almost every day, so it's starting to get familiar for us. On average, most people fly two to three times a year, which makes flying simply an unfamiliar experience that we aren't accustomed to. This lack of familiarity can create anxiety and uncertainty. Finally, the most important reason is this. Since airplane crashes are relatively rare, it is more shocking and unexpected and tends to receive a significant amount of media attention, which can make them more salient in the public consciousness compared to other modes of transportation. Car accidents, on the other hand, are unfortunately more common and therefore may not receive as much attention in the media. This can lead to a perception that air travel is more dangerous than it actually is. That's it for today. I hope that this information helped you understand that flying is much safer than you thought. Let me know in the comments where your next destination will be. Stay safe and see you in the next video.